Hit Film Sensei here. Today we're going to talk about how to do a screen replacement uh, using a very easy and simple quad warp effect in Hit Film 4 Express. Now there's a few things that you have to do when you're shooting this kind of a shot to make sure it's easy to do, but as long as you follow these couple of simple rules that I'm going to light outline, then you'll be good to go. So I'm going to take a piece of raw footage that I filmed uh, and drop it down here. Basically this piece of footage I am just walking up to a television and I'm looking at this really interesting and fascinating uh, television show, right? What I'm going to do is, is notice a couple of things. First of all, that I don't ever cross or reach across or get in the way of the light of, line of sight of the television. That's very important so that there's no masking or keying out or anything that needs to happen there. Also notice that it's a lockdown camera shot. Those two things are going to be very important. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click on this and I'm going to say make a composite shot. Click OK. So now I have a composite shot and I'm going to take my footage that's going to be on the television and I'm going to drop it on top of it. Now it's sort of covering everything but what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a quad warp effect and I'm going to drop it on that footage and then all I have to do is grab the corners of this and I'm going to drag it and as you can tell it's a warping effect so wherever I end up dragging it it's going to look like it naturally belongs there and it's very easy to do I'm just sort of uh, uh, you know grabbing it uh, and putting it in generally and then I'm going to use my mouse wheel to kind of zoom in and I will sort of tweak these to be exactly where I would want them to be. Of course I'd spend more time on this uh, but you know for this example you know again it will go through pretty quickly and there you go and now it, it looks like this is sort of on TV. I'm going to rescale this to fit and now when I walk in you can see how cool that looks yeah, it looks like I'm watching a very fascinating show. And that's how you do it. Now there is a really, really good tutorial. If you are filming this with a handheld shot or for some reason it is actually moving around, the camera is, then HitFilm Quick Tips has a beautiful screen replacement tutorial using Mocha HitFilm. Uh, in the HitFilm 4 Pro and I will leave a link in the description below because it's an absolutely fantastic video if you want to learn how to do this a little more efficiently and, and better using an actual moving camera shot. Uh, so link in the description below. If you have any questions or feedback leave them in the comments section and thanks for watching.